Good morning or good afternoon, Kennedy Cougars. Let's toss it over for, to Cam for some breaking news. Attention, all students taking one or more AP exams this year. If you're taking a morning exam on Monday to Thursday, you're expected to be back to school by the beginning of sixth hour. If you're taking a morning exam on a Friday, you're excused for the entire day. If you're taking an afternoon exam on Monday through Thursday, you're expected after or excused after smart time. If you're taking an afternoon exam on Friday, you're excused after third hour. Please make sure to eat a good breakfast and lunch on exam days. See Ms. R Mrs. Ritchie if you have any questions. For sports, the JV2 girls soccer team lost their opening match of the season at North Scott by a 4-0 score. The team is, in next, is next in action on Thursday, May 3rd at Iowa City High. Congratulations to the men's varsity soccer team who in the last seven days have defeated two top 15 ranked teams and beat another team by a score of 10 to zero. Last night's victory over Crosstown rivals C.R. Wash was four to one in favor of the Cougars with goals scored by senior midfielder Alex Stone, sophomore defender Curtis Ratzer, sophomore forward Kasibo Kasha, and senior forward Yusuf Egram. Our next game is this week against Dubuque Waller and we hope to see you there. The girls golf team finished in second place last night at the their golf meet, beating Iowa City West by one stroke and Jefferson by four strokes. The team was led by Amelia Spritzer. Also scoring for the team were Annette Marsali, Marsali Alani Osterkamp, and Tasha Gillickson. I don't know if you've seen, but there's a brand new grab-and-go breakfast served in the foyer. Cart hours are 7.30 to 9.15 a.m. Breakfast, breakfast meals include a minimum three food items, which includes half cup fruit juice, or juice plus milk. No a la carte options, meals only. On Monday, there is stuffed mini bagels. Tuesday, yogurt with blueberry lemon bites. Wednesday, mini pancakes. Thursday, Sara Lee muffins. And Friday, mini cinnamon rolls. Are you a senior committed to saving lives? Then you may be interested in joining the National Bone Marrow Registry. Patients with leukemia, lymphoma, or other life-threatening illnesses often require a bone marrow transplant to survive and can only receive a transplant from a person with an exact tissue type match. If you're 18 years of age or older committed to donate bone marrow if you are a match what? and meet basic health requirements you are qualified to join for free if you are committed to donating you can sign sign on to the National Bone Marrow Registry today Wednesday May 2nd in the Kennedy IMC anytime until 6 p.m. if you need a pass from your class see any of the representatives of the drive be sure to bring a, dr bring a driver's license or social security number with you if you decide to donate before you decide whether to register as a donor or not, visit www.bethematch.org to learn more about the donation process. Hope to see you there. Attention all freshmen, if you want to play sophomore football this fall, come to room 106 and sign up. There is a, there is a sign-up sheet outside the door, and Coach Anderson will be standing beside it. All right. Prom pictures can be picked up during smart time or before school all this week in Malone's room 107. Wednesday, May 2nd, no lunch in the IMC. Please make other plans. And Friday, the IMC will be closed all day for release students and study hall students. Please make other plans as well. Seniors, if you received a pink slip today from the library, please stop in the IMC and return the overdue books and pay the fines. Senior NHS members, stop in Ms. Casper's room 72 to purchase your graduation cords. The cords are $15. A reminder to students interested in show choir for next year. Dance auditions will be held Wednesday and Thursday in the choir room. Students, students need to attend only one of the four sessions that begin at 3 p.m. and 5 p.m. each day. No need to sign up or prepare anything ahead of time. We'll teach you everything you need in the audition. See Ms. Mr. Ziegler for any questions. Seniors, the class of 2018 decision day is right around the corner. The counseling office invites you to join us this Friday, May 4th, in the Upper IMC between 8.30 and 1.30 p.m. just to celebrate you and your future plans. This event will honor graduating seniors who plan to continue their education at a college or university. Apprenticeship or training program, enlistment in the military, entrance into the workforce, etc. Decision day is part of Iowa College Aid's school-based course to college program. Activities include cookies and lemonade, completing final transcript, transcript requests, and signing the Class of 2018 banner to share your future plans with the Cougar Land, plus so much more. Wear your college-slash-university gear for the 
day and bring your best smile. Photo opportunities will be available. All gradu graduating seniors are welcome. Attention class of 2020. Uh, class of <laughs> class apparel including t-shirts, sweatshirts, and sweatpants are available for sale starting now. All sales are online using the website. Do I say the website? Okay. <laughs> the online store closes on Friday, May 4th, and the items will be delivered to Kennedy for the for pickup in Mr. Bo Mrs. Bover's room on Tuesday, May 15th. Hurry and order order yours today. Contact Betsy and Marlo with any questions. Are you thankful for being healthy? Have you ever known a kid who has been hospitalized for their Ill illnesses? Would you like to help make their hospital stay more comfortable? If you answered yes with that. If you answered yes any of these questions, maybe you should think about contributing to fund to make tie blankets for them. Each blanket costs about $15, but any amount helps. Donations can be brought to Miss Corey in the bookkeeper's office through Friday, May 4th. Calling all artists, we are now taking submissions for the Menagerie, Kennedy's end of the year art showcase. This is a great opportunity to display your artwork here at Kennedy on May 18th. Submission forms are in room 301 and need to be turned in with your piece. All subjects in medium accepted and students may submit up to five pieces. All work must be original. Fan art is not encouraged. Deadline for submissions is Friday, May 4th. See any AP art history student or Mrs. Ennis with questions. Attention seniors, submissions for po Poet Laureate are due Monday, May 7th to any language arts teacher or Mrs. Asmussen. The class of 2018 Poet Laureate will read the original poem at the graduation ceremony and the poem will be included in the program. See your language arts teacher for details. Students, summer school information is avail available in the counseling office. Summer school will be held June 4th through June 29th and attendance is mandatory. Summer school is open to any student who has failed a face-to-face -face class and would like to recover the credit for said class. Students are limited to one class and space is limited, so please stop in the counseling office to pick up the information ASAP. Registration begins immediately until filled. See your counselor with specific questions slash concerns. All right, for today's birthdays, we have Leah Hamstra, Garrett Humbert, Haley Canute, and Lydia Marino. Happy birthday. All right, continuing on, got some activities for today. At 3 p.m., we have a girls' varsity tennis match versus Dubuque Wallert Catholic High School at Dubuque Wallert. 3.15, girls' JV meet versus Iowa City West, Jeff, and Xavier at Finkbein. 4.15, JV2 soccer match versus North Scott. Wait, nope, that got changed yesterday. They already played. That's right. 4.30. JV in one match, girls tennis versus Wash at Vets Memorial Tennis Center. And at 4.30, we have boys JV one tennis versus Washington here at Kennedy. Today's lunch menu is brought to you by the Fixers. You don't really know who they are. They just th fix things. Station one, station two, burger basket with fries. Station three, hot dogs and breaded chicken, salad subs, and parfaits. Station four, the Mighty King Chicken Sandwich. Station five, lasagna roll-ups with garlic toast and sweet potato fries. And your alternate is pepperoni pizza. As always, go Cougs. <laughs>